36. Well, there looks to be an awful lot over here. Look at 36, but you feel that the balls are in absolutely 37. superb places now. Things back in play. It's nothing near a cushion. Playing into areas where he can get on a choice of reds. Just slightly the wrong side here. Does he go all round the table or does he leave the cue ball in the middle of the table? I think he's playing around the angles, pumping it round with that few speed that he's got. Absolutely no problem. It's all so competitive. Ten years since Ding Junhui was the last player to win three in a row. As I say, winning one is an effort. 56. We're getting closer. When he hit that particularly well, I mean, look how millimetre perfect he's played it onto the red. Colour will be enough. Sixty-five. From the pink, to open the reds even more. Then uh, that's where the possible century will come from. This is match ball, tournament ball. Barring snookers, of course, which seems unlikely. Sixty-five. Well, he's played well in the week, but. Wakelin tonight has been on the wrong end of something of a barrage. This is the best I've seen him in, in all of the three weeks that we've seen him pick up titles recently. He's got better, hasn't he? Tournament to tournament. And that's because he's got nothing to prove. He'd love to close this out, of course, with the third century of the evening. He's a unique player, isn't he, Trump? Great shot maker, and it's great for snooker to see him playing once again at his very best. Yeah, I agree, it really is. Eight to nine. Be just two behind the great Steve Davis on the all time list. He'll be in fifth place on 26 titles. His 20th ranking match win in a row. What a month. You know, the clocks went back last night. I think Judd Trump would love to stop, start October again. It's been the month of his life. 97. Here we go then to bring the curtain down on this great event for the third century of the evening. Judd Trump. What a player. Wakelin. What can you do, actually, sit there? He's had a good week, hasn't he, Wakelin? A terrific week, actually. Played very well, but he's just on the wrong end here of this. And what can you do but admire what you see? Yeah, we might see some shots here as well coming up. Seventh frame was the big one. Wakelin looked like he was going to win it. Trump made a wonderful clearance. And since then, he has just motored to the winning line.
He will be going all round the angles again here from pink to black. The shot is on. Come on then, genius, pop this. in a row what an extraordinary achievement by an incredible player